rotation inside that lower back. That left leg is shorter than the right leg. Definitely that way. What I'd like you to do with this right leg is I just want you to lift it up for a second and come right back down. I'm just going to tap this joint inside here just a bit, okay? If it's too strong, you just, just tell me, okay? Tap it nice and easy. You okay? Yeah. Good. So you ride a long board, you ride a short board. It's a regular skateboard. Oh, yeah? Raise this leg one more time, then go up, then back down. Nice, nice. Let's check that other side. What's with these, uh, I see these people riding these really super short skateboards. Oh, yeah. You know? Yeah. You know, never really got into that. No, huh? Yeah. What's funny is that years ago, when skateboards came out here in the Northeast, all the boards were short, just like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So it's like a, it's like a retro board. Yeah, it's like going back in time. Oh, isn't that crazy? These guys, these people are using these same boards. Yeah. It was interesting. I was watching an interview with Tony Hawk the other day. Mm -hmm. They were talking about how much money he's made just from his video games. Just yeah. the video games, all right? Yeah, not, not, not the boards, nothing like that. The video games alone, it was over a billion dollars. Insane, right? Isn't that crazy? Yeah. That doesn't even make sense. All right. And just relax the side here. Good. In fact, Tony Hawk's video game, his skateboarding game, Came out, you remember, before a lot of those basketball games. Yeah, that was, it was one of the first things. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The skateboarding games were one of the first ones that were made, just to give you an idea of how old Tony Hawk is, or how the dude. Yeah, dudes, he still the dudes, has them on the PC. Yeah, that's still <laughs> on the PC. The dude is like the OG of ever, of all those things. Yeah. I'm gonna adjust right in your middle back. I'd like you to just. You see, you have a little. You do have a little curvature inside there, yeah. just like that. So right inside there, it's where you build up most of your pressure, your tension. Yeah, yeah. So I want you to breathe in very deep for me, and breathe all the way out. Good, good, good. One more time. We need to breathe in again, and all the way out. Good. And we're going to go right up top inside here. You just relax and lean here to the side. Good. Just breathe easy. Good. Good. And go on the other side also. Excellent. Good. Good. But yeah, man, that guy, that guy's still making residuals oh, yeah. from video games that came out <laughs> back in the day. Yep. Right? That's nuts. But why don't you come on your side, just face my doorway if you can, okay? And rest your head right there, bro. So I'm going to just turn you a little bit here. That's cool. Right there. I'm just going to bend that way, just like that. Now let it relax. And we'll be a little closer if you don't want. Awesome. Good. Let your legs and your hips just kind of fall down a little bit. Good. That's it. But I just want you to breathe in for me. And breathe out. Good. Go on the other side, please. Bend that. And just let that drop also. Cool. Breathe in for me really deep. And out. Awesome. Nice. Lay right on your back like a clunk. Lay on your back face up and bend your knees. Right there. Like this? Yeah. You want to work on your feet also. All right. So, bend your knees. Bend the other one. Good. What I want you to do is squeeze your legs together hard. Good. Separate. Separate them. Good. Let this yeah, drop. This is the, the, the knee I... Uh, oh, yeah? I injured. Let's check it out. You still have pain in there? A little bit. It's more like, I don't know, it's like not used to... Any pain in my left hand? Good. It's all right. But just relax the leg. I'm going to do a circle here. I'm just going to do a circle with your hip. Let it drop. I'm going to let it drop all the way. Cool. That's it. 
Again, do it again. Put it all the way down. Good. Relax the knee. Just let it drop. Let it relax a little more. Good. Let it drop down. Like that. And stretch out your hip joint. Awesome. Good. Let it go. Just going to come right up top. Just like that. Point your toe to your chin. Straight down. Get a good stretch in there. Nice, nice. Let's check out the other knee. The other way. So just relax and do a nice big circle here. Good. Nice big circle. Good. Good. Just going to see if we can open the, the knee joint up a little bit. Just let it go. Any pain when I do that? Yeah. A little bit, right? Let it drop inside here. Going to stretch out the hip joint. Just like this. You okay? Cool. Come back here, I'm going to lift up, let it straighten out, pull your toe to your chin. You okay with that? Good. Okay, we'll adjust your knee now. Okay, we're going to adjust both knees. First things first. I'm just going to do it gently, you're going to feel, it's not going to hurt, it's not going to hurt. Just Same thing in here. Now you're going to feel this drop. It's not going to hurt. That's all I'm going to feel. All right. Just going to open the knee joint up a little bit. Just like that. Once again. Good. Awesome. Check the outside. Same way. Just let it relax easy. That's what you're going to feel. Mm -hmm. External, just relax it. Good. Awesome. Just relax that ankle a bit. And open up the ankle joint. Good. Right side there. Good. And let it go. Good. Walk on the other one. Just let the ankle relax. Good. And open that up just a little bit more. Relax. Good. Okay. Just going to open up your stand a little bit. Bring it right down inside here. Kind of lock it a bit. And keep your hands right here if you don't mind. Get a little wide strap on you. Just open up those joints inside the neck area. All we do is you close your mouth, just kind of breathe in through your nose and out through your nose. Just kind of focus in. I'm going to put just a little gentle stretch inside here. Just like, mm -hmm. just a little stretch. I want you to breathe in very deep. And I like you to breathe all the way out. Just kind of let it go a little bit. Just like that. Just like that here. Lift up a little bit. Good, rest your head. How are we doing? Slide up a little bit towards me, just a bit, and rest your head right here. Good. Okay, let's just relax nice and easy. Good. Just going to put a gentle stretch inside here. A little bit more, let it go. Good. I'm going to go one more inside here. Good. And just relax a bit. Just stretch inside here just a bit more. Just to open the joint a little bit. It's going to be a little tight inside there. Just kind of go. Good. How did that feel? Good. Good. You feel all that open up inside there? Yeah. Yeah, right? Good. Okay, we're going to work on your shoulders now. and easy. Legs right over there. Sit right in the middle. Cool. Stay there for a second. Give my hammer a little bit more. Turn your head to the left. Good. Excellent. Look straight ahead, please. Just relax the side here. Good. 
I think the problem with some of these dealerships, no cars. Hmm. Yeah, that's what they told me. The guy told me, we only have about 200. He said, he turned to the right, nice and easy. He said, we only have about 22 on the lot. Oh, really? That's amazing, isn't it? Yeah, it's crazy. Depends on the time. Yeah. Time of year, I guess. Look yeah. straight ahead. They said something about not having the chip. These cars on oh. the chips. Whatever yeah. that means. Is that a is that a thing? Some. I mean, it depends on the dealership, I guess. Yeah. So they're telling me. Because oh. uh, you know they all have different. Um, I'm seeing that. I'm seeing that in a lot of dealerships. Take this one. Pull it down for a second. I'm going to ask you to pull your elbow back in a second. Okay. Pull it back. Harder. And relax, let's try the other side. Same thing. Hold on a second. Hold on, hold on. Pull back. There we go. That was easy. <laughs> this one's stubborn. Let me yeah. take this. Let it drop. Good, just let it relax a little bit. Good. There we go. And just relax it a little bit. Awesome. Relax. Relax your shoulders. Just take your elbow. Yeah, so they said something about the chips in the cars. That's weird. Yeah. So when, I, when I worked in Nissan, there was, uh, it was all like mostly warranty work. Like they had. Yeah. Uh, they all needed like reprograms and stuff like yeah, that. Exactly. So it was like. That was like the main thing. Toronto, if you're new to the channel, then just click below and you can subscribe and you'll get new videos sent to your email box every single week. If you like these videos, please support my channel by checking out my Crackamaniac t-shirts by clicking on the link below. And also, I really appreciate those people that support me through things like PayPal and Patreon and also sponsoring individual videos. You know what? I really couldn't make these videos without you guys, so I thank you so much. So I'll talk to you soon. I'll check you out next week.